video again? You just got through taping. Please don't say it that way. It's our lovely daughter, both yours and mine. Don't you want to capture her childhood on videotape? If you keep doting on her like that, she won't grow up to be strong. Serene is different from the other children. I wonder what dangers await her. Oh, I don't know. How about a giant mouse and you and I going right through a freaking abdomen? What? Except for all swords, it's called the Mouse Immune. And. Uh, yeah, she. I think it's an eight foot long sword. The look on your face! <laughs> You're just sitting there like. They were born from a sword. No, 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 no. Serene was born from these two. But what dangers does she face? How about an eight foot long sword? Yeah. <laughs> Going through her gullet. Well, it's supposed to go through her gullet. It's supposed to go through here, up there. But it said it goes through her back. But that's not the question. I have a feeling like when he went down, he was just like, hang on, I'm just going to quickly change the angle and... <laughs> yeah. You and Serene are my only treasures. I'll never let you go. Aww. Aww. I was just about to what? What were you just about to do, sir? <laughs> How dare they intrude on our private time together. Am I about to watch a guy eat a fucking ice pod? What? <laughs> the thing I'm about to is see a guy eat an ice pod. Y you do know what an ice pod is, right? No. It's a deep sea... Pretty much a deep sea roly poly that is roughly the size of your hand. Yeah. Hold on, I will send you a photo. I don't want to think about that. I don't even know. No. No. Actually, you rather cute looking. Uh, why do we eat cute things? I said it is rather cute. I know. Plus, it's China. What do you expect? Why do we eat cute things? Uh, hold on. Yeah, uh, so Professor Gast is Serene's father. Per se, is its face. Ugh. How is that cute? I said it's rather cute. How? For what it is. How? 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 Is it? how? It's called the giant Asabon. It's a bug. It's a giant bug. It's a deep sea bug, yes. It's a giant bug. <laughs> I don't want to eat a giant bug. It's rather cute to me. <laughs> Bugs are cute to you. It looks like a giant trilobite. Because it is. It looks like a trilobite. It pretty much is a trilobite. It's a larger form of the trilobite, pretty much. Thanks for your kindness. I don't see how you think that thing is slightly cute. I don't. It's a bug. It's a giant bug. That's adorable! It's a giant bug! It's not a bug. It's a crustacean. It's a sea bug. It's adorable! 
I don't see how that- you don't think that's cute! Ah, oh, shit. Why won't you Shinra leave me alone? Pretty sure it's on the, uh, Marianas Crunch. It looks adorable. No! It's not! <laughs> it's a bug! <laughs> Bye, Elena. <laughs> Ew, that is not cute. It's adorable. It is not. <laughs> Jerry, what do you think of it? It looks adorable, doesn't it? She's just... She doesn't know what to think of it. She's just staring at it. <laughs> it's pretty much just a mess of roly-poly. Roly-polies are adorable. Why is it... Why is that not adorable? I, I, did, I never really liked... Roly-polies. I just got called a fathead. <laughs> <laughs> I just got called a fat head. <laughs> Are you good at puzzles? <laughs> hmm? Are you good at puzzles? What's the puzzle exactly here? Uh, if I land on these, the small ones grow big and the big ones go small. I have to get to the other side. Ah, and I'm guessing you can't land on the small ones. No. Pump on that one. Uh, jump on the medium one, to in front of you. See what happens there. Alright. Down to the large one, to your right. Jump to the one in front of you. Oh, yeah, to your side. To your side. Forward. Thank you! Get me out of here! <laughs> How long were you stuck on that? A uh, few minutes there. <laughs> That's one of the simplest puzzles. <laughs> I'm not good at puzzles all the time. I'm good at simple ones where it's like push this here, push that there. But when it comes to things like that, no, I go dumb. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What, just the no, I go dumb thing? <laughs> no, I go dumb. <laughs> no, I go dumb. I went the wrong way, too. <laughs> uh, I have to go back. I have to go back. <laughs> Uh-oh. Down. Sideways. Left. Yeah, I better not. I, I, no, I better not go that way. If I go that way, I was gonna drown. Mm. Freedom! Damn it! <laughs> Either way, those puzzles are rather easy. Ah, I go dumb. Oh, look at it! It's cute! We're going to kill it. It hurts. <laughs> <laughs> It's so cute! It fucking hurts! <laughs> what are you? Ice golem. What? You're an that's ice a That's a tiny ass golem, and it looks more like a mega. Ow! It's adorable, damn it. It looks like a tiny transformer. <laughs>
Well, Matthias is definitely using a different brand of shotgun now. Hmm. Yeah, that... That's a Winchester... lever gun turned into a pump shotty. I don't like that. Uh, what's it called? That I do not like. It's called the Lariat. It looks like a Winchester lever gun turned pump shoddy. I don't like it. It works. <laughs> Look at the way Anus is trying to warm himself up. <laughs> <laughs> God damn, I got some itchy thighs! <laughs> what the fuck is she doing over there in the corner? Who, uh, the one with long hair, Duck Lutana? Yeah. I think she's rubbing yeah. her thighs, because bear in mind she is wearing a miniskirt. <laughs> Either rubbing her thighs or something completely different. <laughs> what do you think she's doing? What does it look like she's doing? Don't look at me. <laughs> <laughs> Don't look at me. <laughs> you know, I've been thinking, what is it? Seeing a place like this makes you realize how awesome nature is. But if anyone ever told me to live here, I'd tell them to, well, you know. Fuck out. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing, though. If I did have to live here, I'd change things around and make it better. I guess Midgar's the total opposite of this place. Oh, Even God. If that way, the Shinra don't seem so bad. What the hell am I saying? The show are not bad? We'll secure the route. Hit him and Ninja is just sitting there dancing around. Well, she... Her whole belly is exposed. Yeah. The only one smart enough to bring clothing is the one that's rowing his fucking thighs. If I was back in the air, this cliff would be nothing. You know what? Anus, come here. I have some equipment. Have, I have equipment for you guys. Come here. 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 Wait, who the fuck's the hat? Mippy. Mippy? Mippy. 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 Actual name? No, his name is Catsy. 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 Well, it's spelled Kate Sith, but it's pronounced Catsy. Hmm. I'm guessing he has no fucking problem with this shit. He's a toy! <laughs> He's a toy? He's a toy! <laughs> <laughs> He's a toy. <laughs> I feel like I just broke your mind with that. Get You know, I, I want to see what, I, I want to see what, what do you have to say, Mippy? What do you have to say? This is secret info, but Rufus is going to arrive here. Okay. What about you, Bjorn? I wonder what's at the top of that mountain. We shall see. Uh, Matthias? I wonder what's on the other side of that cliff. He doesn't seem too bothered by the cold. Well, it would help that he's in a fucking full-ass cape that he can just drape around himself, so. Meanwhile, she's over there rubbing her thighs. <laughs> I hope. What? You really think she's just going to be doing that in front of everyone? Hey, it produces a lot of heat. No kidding! Get <laughs> the look on your face! Huh? Oh, hi, buddy! What happened? What am I fighting against? It's like a chimera. Oh, 
Odin, I need your help. <laughs> I'm fighting a two-headed dragon. Definitely a chimera. Oh, I think I get it. His name isn't Shizo, it's Schizo. This thing literally is the epitome of schizophrenia. Uh-oh. Matthias is gonna die. Ugh! And so did Bjorn. Oh, there's only one survivor! Screw you! I'm alive! Oh, I just saw a chair go flying out right by the window. I just saw a chair go flying. <laughs> oh. Go buy that chair. I'm not gonna go get it. <laughs> uh, how many chairs do you lose a year? <laughs> well, I don't really lose them. I go out there and get them. <laughs> but that, that chair just went flying again. <laughs> Why don't y'all, like, weigh down the chairs whenever it's a windy are. day? They usually are. <laughs> we put rocks on them, but they still go flying. They're not putting enough rocks on them. An old crater. Something fell out of the sky and crashed down here. Yeah, it's called Genova. Leaving a scar on the planet. It's a massive, vast amount of energy to heal itself. Sephiroth took that energy and is trying to use Meteor. Next time, the wound won't be so small. God, I can hear that wind. How fast is the wind going? How fast is that wind going? Um, 26 miles oh. per hour. Nice. <laughs> I'm staying inside. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I don't like that! What is that? What are you? Gigas. Oh. Oh, it's easy to kill. You have to ask, when you see a creature this big, who makes its shoes? <laughs> Moon Wars? What are you gonna do to me? Ugh! gonna walk up to me and sucker punch me? Rude. Back to Sephiroth. Daputana? Please take me with you. You're going after Sephiroth, aren't you? Shit. I've lost a lot because of Sephiroth too, so please take me along. Don't say no. Do it! I don't want you in my party, Dutch Fatana! Look at you, you're almost ten levels lower than me! Uh-oh. Dude! Sephiroth? What the hell? This is the end. You're right. This is the end of this body's usefulness. Excuse me? What? Huh? He might still be nearby. Our purpose is to deliver the black materia to our master. Who said that?
Those who carry Genova's cells. Master. Of course, Sephiroth. Oh boy. I bombed my ass. Mm. Excuse me? Not another one! Kill it! I have no idea what Genova this is. I fought Genova Birth and I fought Genova Life. I don't know what this one is. Red Light. Alright, so that's Fire Base. Thank you. Yes, keep hitting Dubutani. You're not gonna get anywhere with that. Okay, that's going on, Bjorn. That's gonna hurt. Yeah, that hurt. Ow. Don't hit Bjorn. That's good. Bonk, bonk. I remember hearing this theme always kind of gave me the heebie-jeebies. Tropic Wind. You know, okay, I don't know what kind of Genova you are, but can you continue to be a dumbass, please? Keep using your fire attacks on Deputana. Do you know silence her Why? Jammer? Oh, Deputana absorbs fire magic. She gets healed by it. Huh. So yes, please keep using it on Deputana. I'd much appreciate it. Meanwhile, I'm going to keep kicking you in your... Knees? Your feet? Do you even have an ass? Is that your ass I'm kicking? I don't know. What am I kicking? I'm kicking something. <laughs> what am I kicking? <laughs> I don't know. All I know is I can see its heart pulsing, and I don't like it. Ugh. Ow. Ow. Kick, kick. Flop. Blood Fang. Tropic Wind. That is going... Oh, Bjorn, no. Bjorn, no. Bjorn, no! Oh. Bjorn! What did Bjorn do? He died. Well, yeah. Aren't you near the final boss? Not even. There's three parts of the game and I just started part two. Mm. Bonk, bonk. Because I know this is not Genova Absolute. This is Genova something. I'll I'll look it up later. Because freaking Matthias was the one who had my sense materia. But no, Deputana just had to walk into my party. She just had to come along. And I couldn't get my materia off Matthias. Ugh. I should probably just make my life a hell of a lot easier and... Ow. Is that gonna hit Dut? Yeah, it's gonna hit Dut. I should make my life a hell of a lot easier and use my M barrier? Never mind, it's dead. <laughs> Never mind, it's dead. What the hell, Genova, was that? Barrier just leveled up. Reflect ring. Ooh, nice. Genova cells. So that's what this is all about. The Genova re reunion. Not Sephiroth? You mean all this time it wasn't Sephiroth we've been after? I'll explain later. Right now, the only thing I'm thinking about is beating Sephiroth. But Sephiroth is... Uh. He's here. The real Sephiroth is just beyond here. And that's the Black Materia. 
It's both incredibly wicked and cruel, but it's releasing a powerfully strong will from deep within the planet's wound. Receive the key item, Black Materia. The Black Materia is back in our hands. Now all we have to do is defeat Sephiroth, and that'll be the end of it. We better not take the Black Materia any further. Why don't you give it to someone else to hold on to? Frankly, I don't want you in my party. You take it. We better not take the Black Materia any further. Why don't you give it to someone else to hold on to? You don't want it. You don't want the Materia that you're forcing me to carry. Okay. I see. I see how it is. I see how it is, Dut. Uh, my barrier one leveled up. There it is, barrier. Now I have reflect. Um, we'll check back here. You, can you carry it? No, not the black materia, please. You don't want it. Okay, what about you? Give the black materia to Derek. I'll think about it. What a damn crazy fucker. <laughs> Sephiroth, what a damn crazy fucker. I don't want anything to do with the black materia. Says the one who stole all my materia before. Me and black materia just don't mix. How about if you hold on to the black materia? I don't think I can do that. Okay, so I can give it to Derek. Who else can I give it to? What's happening, Zeris? That wasn't Sephiroth. Okay, so we're going to give it to Derek then. Derek is the only one who will take it. The pressure's on now. Don't give it to anyone. Is the I'm black materia? To the black guy. Um. <laughs> no, that's not what I'm asking. I'm asking what is it? Uh, the black materia summons meteor, which can destroy the planet. That look on your face. You see why I'm trying to keep it away from Sephiroth? And you're giving it to the big, massive black guy with a gun for him. Well, I can't give it to anyone else. No one wants to take it. Why don't you keep it on your purse? Because Sephiroth will take control of me and I'll give it back to him again. Mm. Uh. Oh, come on now. Let's find Sephiroth. We're going in first. You guys stay and keep watch. There's Derek. Oh, what's this? Fuck! <laughs> Ow. Bop, bop. Yeah. We destroyed an entire temple to get the Black Materia. The temple itself was the Black Materia. <clears throat> so, technically, Derek is holding your temple. Yes. You got a problem with that? <laughs> you look like you do, but you don't. <laughs> you look conflicted with that face. You're just like, do I have a problem with this? MP Turbo. Well, that's a problem. I want to know how. I, I, I don't know how to. I don't. I, I can't explain it. I can't explain it. Oh, I can PHS it. Debutana, can I get you out of my party? No. Okay, then I'll just do this. Matthias, I, I need my materia back, please. Boop, 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 boop. You know what? No. 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 I can... Yeah, I can do this. As much as I love having, um... Bjorn in my party. Matthias has the most slots. And let's see. Yeah, MP plus. And he's already got a bunch of materia on him. Bjorn can just chill back there. Poison ring. 
Oh, it's never good when they give you something like that. Uh, Defutana, we'll, we'll go ahead and give you Throw, Steal, Morph, and Manipulate. You will be our yellow Materia Handler. <laughs> we get sapped by lightning. Oh, it's just one of you. Where's Dud? There's Dud. There we go. I cross through. Oh. I was just being impatient. What is this? What happened? Calm down, Dupfutana. Sephiroth is near. Anything could happen. Wait a minute. This is Nibelheim. Why? Is it an illusion? I don't know. Probably. This is an illusion Sephiroth made up. He's trying to confuse us. It'll be alright as long as we know it's an illusion. There's nothing to be afraid of. Come on, let's keep going. Yeah, you're right. Jazzy, can you not bury your head in between my tits, please? <laughs> That's not Zerus. Who is this man? Huh? This is so stupid. Now, how can we get out of here? Zerus, it's just an illusion. Don't worry about it. What's next? All this happened while I slept? <laughs> That's right! Matthias was in the basement of that manor. He was like, wait, this happened while I was asleep? This is what actually happened five years ago. But it's probably not me that will come out of the Shinra Mansion. He's going to try and show us another stupid illusion. See? Didn't I tell you? If you remember some time ago, Zerus told us the story of what happened. But if you notice, that's not Zerus. That's someone else. What's wrong, Dr. Tom? I told you before, right? As long as we know that's just an illusion, there's no need to be scared. Are you alright? It was an illusion. <coughs> Sephiroth, I know you're listening. I know what you want to say. That I wasn't in Nibelheim five years ago. That's it, isn't it? I see you finally understand. I'm gonna kill you. What are you trying to say is that you want me to confuse me, right? But even making me see those things won't affect me. I remember it all. The heat of the fire, the pain in my body, and in my heart. Oh, is that so? You're just a puppet. You have no heart and cannot feel any pain. How can there be any meaning in the memory of such a being? What I have shown you is reality. 
What you remember? That is the illusion. Well, that's just rude. Zerus. Hey, uh, how about I take my Buster Sword and clock you right in the nuts? Do you understand? Mm, no. I don't want to understand. But I want to ask you one thing. Why? Why are you doing this? Of course. I want to take you back to your real self. The one who gave me the black materia that day. Who would ever thought a failed experiment would prove so useful? Hojo would die if he knew. Hojo? What does he have to do with me? Five years ago, you were constructed by Hojo, piece by piece, right after Nibelheim was burnt. A puppet made up of vibrant Genova cells, her knowledge, and the power of the Mako. Ugh, Jazzy, why? <laughs> <laughs> An incomplete Sephiroth clone, not even given a number. That is your reality. Well, that's just fucked up. Zerus, don't listen to him. Cover your ears, close your eyes. What's wrong, Dutbutana? I'm not affected by it. I wasn't paying attention to him. All that talk of Hojo constructing you is a lie. Don't we have our memories together? Being kids together? Starlit nights? Oh boy. Why are you so worried and scared by those words? Shall I show everyone here what's in your heart? What? You don't look well. Oh. Dabutana, is Sephiroth right? What do you have to say about this, Matthias? He's just like, I'm just gonna sit here and enjoy the show. <laughs> Zerus, why are you so scared? Don't worry about me, I'm alright. No matter how confused I am, I'll never believe a word that Sephiroth says. God, I can barely say his name because of this stupid list. It's true that sometimes I can't figure out who I am. There's a lot of things muddled up in my memories. But that Putana? You said, long time no see, Zerus, right? Those words will always support me. I'm the one you grew up with. I'm Zerus of Nibelheim. No matter how much I lose faith in myself, that is the truth. That's why you shouldn't be so scared. No matter what anyone else says to me, it's your opinion that counts. No, that's not true, Zerus. What's not? I'm the same Zerus you grew up with, aren't I? That's not what I mean. I don't know how to say it. Zerus, I need some time. Just give me a little time. <laughs> Zerus, don't blame Dabutana. The ability to change one's looks, voice, and words is the power of Genova. Inside of you, Genova has merged with Dabutana's memories, creating you. Out of Dabutana's memory. A boy named Zerus might have just been a part of them. Ooh. Please don't think right now. Oh, God, he's trying to give me an existential crisis, isn't he? <laughs> think, Zerus. Zerus? Oh, excuse me, you never had a name. Shut up, Sephiroth. You still don't understand, then. Oh, boy. Laugh it up, Mr. Chucklebutt. Do you remember the picture that we took before we headed for Mount Nebel? Dufatana, you remember, right? But there's no way he would know. Now, what happened to that picture? Oh, it's in that guy's pocket. He's the photographer. Is this it? Do you want to see it? It turned out pretty good. Zerus, don't. I should be in the picture. Even if I'm not in there, no worry. This is just an illusionary world Sephiroth made up. I have no control. Yep. Zerus isn't there. <laughs> Jazzy, get your paw off my tit. 
Just as I thought. This picture is a fake. The truth is in my memory. Five years ago, I came back to Mebelheim to inspect the reactor. I was 16. The town hadn't changed at all. What did I do? Oh, yeah. I saw my mom. I saw the people in town. Yeah, I went to Dovatana's room. There, I... I spent the night and went to the reactor in Mount Meeble. I was excited about it. Because that was my first mission after becoming first class in Soldier. Soldier? First class? Soldier. When did I answer Soldier? How did I join Soldier? Uh oh. Oh shit. That's right. I didn't have to worry about it because I was. Saris! Let's go, Zabutana. I'm, I'm alright. I'm concerned! On many levels! Zerus is tripping balls, dude. It's all materia. That's materia? The outsider is rich with Mako energy. The inside is a treasure trove of materia. This truly is the promised land. There's no such thing as the promised land. It's a legend. An old wives' tale. It's utterly ridiculous. Says the scientist who created Sephiroth. Everything's as I imagined it to be. Isn't it splendid? Is that the kind of dullness that makes you a second-rate scientist? What is what's happening? It's coming from within the wall. Something's in there. It's moving. Oh, God! That was an eyeball! What? really does exist. I didn't believe in it. What does this mean? A monster created by the planet. They appear when the planet's in danger and destroy everything. That's what was stated in Professor Gass's report. I never saw that report. Where is it? Here. Right here. <laughs> yeah, that thing's alive! Um... Are mm -hmm. Zerus and the others all right? But what's up with that? One little piece of materia destroying the planet. Derek? Derek, what's happening? Derek? Derek? He's tripping balls. Is is his gun arm secretly a bong or something? What did he smoke? What's going on? Huh? Derek, you're here. I'm so glad. Deputana. Something we something's weird here. It got pitch black all of a sudden and everyone disappeared. That did not look like pitch black. That looked like swamp ass. Yeah. <laughs> Everyone's waiting. Saris is in trouble. Please come help us. Over there. I don't know what's going on, but let's just get on with it. Wait, Derek, you have the black materia. No, 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 no. Derek, no. Derek, Derek, you get your chunky ass back. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What happened to everybody? I don't get Sephiroth's just urge to destroy everything. He wants to merge himself with the planet so he can become a god. Because what runs the planet is the life stream. The life stream is consisted of the souls of everything in the planet. Plants, animals, humans, everything merges into the life stream. Ain't there space travel in this game? No. Mm. But see, 
the live stream, Sephiroth is going to try and create a wound in the planet, and a live stream will converge on that location. At the center of where it's going to happen is going to be him, so he will become a god. That's his plan. That doesn't make sense. It's a typical evil dude wanting to become a god complex. It's so typical. But how would merging with a planet make you a god? The soul of every single living creature on the planet merging with you, turning you into the ultimate god, basically like Genova. That would just become a massive headache since you would have the voice of multiple millions of people in the back of your fucking head. Nope, <laughs> apparently not. Can you imagine hearing a, a cow out of nowhere in the back of your head just pierce out? <laughs> Shut up, Jerry! <laughs> ben and Jerry's. <laughs> you walked into that. I mean, you walked into it. It makes no sense. I try not to question things too much because all it does is break my mind. I don't know how I got here, don't ask me. I'm just a walking grape with a freaking blonde boy shove a chocobo's ass on my head. <laughs> Ugh. Why did that sip of tea taste like cigarettes? Ugh. Ugh. This is where the reunion is happening, where everything begins and ends. Uh oh. He can't hear Death Butana. Wait. What's happening? I have absolutely no control. I'm trying to seize control and I have no control. Thanks, Derek. Where's the black materia? Oh, Jesse! Why would you do this to me? It's safe. I have it. I'll take it from here. Give me the black materia. Nope. We can't hear Deputana. Okay, then here. Had a lot of pressure holding this thing. Please stop, Zerus! Come on. The black materia. Please wait just a little longer. What? What's going on? Everyone, thanks for everything, and I'm sorry. 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 This <laughs> just hurts everyone. Sorry. I'm sorry. Especially you, Deputana. I'm really sorry. You've been so good to me. I don't know what to say. I never lived up to being Zerus. Deputana, maybe one day you'll meet the real Zerus. means my experiment was a complete success. Yeah, oh, 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 I'm just, oh, oh, no. I'm just a clown. Now I'm trying to picture Sephiroth with long, flowing, golden locks. <laughs> it's weird to me. Mm. Ew. What number were you? Huh? Where's your tattoo? Professor Hojo, I don't have a number. You didn't give me one because you thought I was a failed experiment. What the? You mean only a failure made it here? Well, excuse me, princess. Professor, please give me a number. Please, Professor. Shut up, miserable failure. Well, fuck you. Hey! 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 Who was that? He's a Sephiroth clone I created after the real Sephiroth died five years ago. Genova Cells and Mako, with my knowledge and skills, have been combined with science and nature to bring him to life. Wait, Sephiroth? So your character is a Sephiroth clone, and I'm guessing Sephiroth is also a Sephiroth clone from the real Sephiroth that died five years ago. I don't know! That is what I'm hearing. <laughs> That's what I'm hearing, but I'm 
defense, the Sephiroth you fight is the same one from before, yet it just said that Sephiroth died five years ago. So if you're a clone of Sephiroth, Sephiroth, Sephiroth died five years ago and you're fighting Sephiroth now, wouldn't that make him a clone as well? Unless the Sephiroth that died wasn't actually Sephiroth, or he didn't actually die, he instead went somewhere else. I don't know! I'm not wild about the failure part, but the Genova reunion theory has now been proven. You see, even if Genova's body is dismembered, Ooh. it will eventually become one again. That's what is meant by Genova's reunion. Oh, shit. I've been waiting for the reunion to start. Five years have passed, and now the clones have begun to return. I thought the clones would begin to gather at Midgar, where Genova is stored. But my predictions were not entirely correct. Genova itself began to move away from the Shinra building. You mean that headless freak show I showed you got up and walked out of the building? What? You remember that headless freak show of Genova I showed you? Yes. Apparently it got up and walked out of the building on its own. <laughs> I... I don't want to picture how disgusting that would look. Why am I up here? <laughs> Why am I upside down? <laughs> but being the genius that I am, I soon figured it out. You see, it was all Sephiroth's doing. Sephiroth is not just content to diffuse his will into the life stream. He wants to manipulate the clones himself. So he's here. Yes, that was how it got started. I wondered where the clones were going, but I was never like, nibble. No, nibble, nibble to figure it out. <laughs> God damn the sword. I couldn't figure it out either. The one thing that I did know was that Sephiroth was at their final destination. I wasn't pursuing Sephiroth. I was being summoned by Sephiroth. All the anger and hatred I bore him made it impossible for me to ever forget him. That and what he gave me. Sephiroth? Sephiroth, I'm here. And I brought you the Black Materia. Where is he? Show yourself to me. Where are you? Great question. Where is he? Oh, um... Better question. Why are you on the seal? I don't know! Sephiroth. So we finally meet again. Wait. Is he in that? Oh! Oh, he's in that! Where's his ass? Did you see it? It's Sephiroth. So he is here. This is perfect. Both Genova's reunion and Sephiroth's will. They won't be diffused into the live stream, but gathered here. Oh, God. What are you so happy about, Professor? You know what this means, don't you? Zerus has the black materia. Sephiroth is going to summon Meteor. Every single person is going to die. Whatever I say now, it's too little too late. We must evacuate. Oh boy. I want you all to come with me. There's still much more I want to know. I don't think I have a choice, do I? So, Sephiroth is in that thing. It, it looks like an egg sack. What's happening to me? Hey, stop throwing me around. I'm not a voodoo doll. Stop it. Ew. Ew. Oh, shit. 
Oh god. It's awake. It's awake. Oh shit. We have woken up hell. We have woken up hell. Everyone get out of there now! Holy shit! Oh god. Oh, this isn't good. Oh my god! Um, I'd fly away if I were you. Did I just count four weapons? Uh -huh. There are four weapons that just got unleashed on the world. Oh no. And those things are designed to kill Genova. Uh -huh. I think we're screwed. Oh, that's the cries of the planet. Zerus? Zerus, I can't do anything. Zerus, Zerus. No, get back here. Get back here, you walking chocobo's ass. Get back here. And he walked away. Great. And I fell. I didn't know what to do. I was always like that. Great! So all the boosts I gave to Zerus mean nothing now that he's gone again! What's the matter? Huh? Poor kid. Are you alright? Dafutana? Dafutana? Whoa! She... Oh, Zerus! That's right, I'm Zerus. Is it really you, Zerus? I never thought I'd find you here. So he never existed? Yeah, it's been a while. What happened to you? You don't look well. Yeah? It's nothing. I'm okay. How long has it been? Oh, shit. Five years. What is it? It's really been a long time. Actually... It's been seven years. You joined Soldier but quit after the Sephiroth incident, and now you're a mercenary. You told me a lot about what happened after you left Nibelheim. But... Something was wrong. I felt there was something strange about the things you talked about. All the things you didn't know that you should, and other things you shouldn't know that you did. I wanted to make sure. But then I heard... You were going far away. And I didn't want that. I didn't know what to do. So I thought I needed more time. And that's why I told you about the avalanche job. I wanted to be with you and watch you. So she was playing babysitter. Oh god. Oh god. The cries of the planet. Oh god. I feel bad for the planet. I kind of wonder what our planet would sound like if we could hear it crying out, though. Hang on. 
had to blow out the candle. Why am I on an operating table? Ding. <laughs> Just ding. Huh? The glare. You'll be better soon. You've been asleep for a long time. How long has she been asleep? Someone just burped. I'm hungry. <laughs> That's me when I wake up after a migraine and do snap. I'm hungry. Hey, why don't you ask? About him. Oh, there went another chair. <laughs> because I'm scared. Don't worry. I don't know what happened to Zerus either. Yes, I shouldn't tell you not to worry. None of them know if he's all right either. He's still alive, right? How long was I asleep? Let's see now. Must have been about seven days. Damn! What about Sephiroth? You ain't over it yet? Remember that huge light in the northern cave? Since then, the crater's been surrounded by a huge barrier of light. Everyone knows Sephiroth sleeps in that big hole protected by the barrier. We can't do a damn thing about it. We just gotta wait till he wakes up. And on top of that, some huge monster called Weapon's been on a rampage. Weapon? Remember that huge monster that was with Sephiroth at the bottom of the crater? Well, it's up here now. They say it's some legendary monster from the past. Weapon is protecting Sephiroth? Don't know, but he's up here going around tearing stuff up. Right now, Rufus is fighting it. I hate to say it, but he's got guts. We should have been the ones to destroy it, but we ain't got no time. Time. Hey, how about Meteor? Yeah, how about that? What about Meteor? I think we're fucked. What do you think? Huh? I think we're fucked. Oh, I'm Dep Butana. Do we have to give up? Don't know. Oh, hi! I thought Zerus would show up to save you all. Professor Hojo wanted to check up on Zerus, too. Of course he did. What are you going on to do to Zerus? Sephiroth's alter ego. Meteor has been summoned. Essentially, it's all but over now. Okay. So there's no need for you now. No, maybe there is an important task for you. Like what? Preparations for the public execution are... Uh, what? 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 They're gonna execute us? You're being ex executed for causing this situation. Dude. Dude. That's like executing a person for being in the same room as someone who ripped ass and accidentally caused a kid to vomit. What the hell? Guilty by association, huh? You're gonna kill me because I happen to be going after Sephiroth, which you guys created. Assholes. Well, enjoy your last moments together. Ugh. I'll tie your arms now. Just come here. Let me let me tie your arms. Oh wait, nay 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 I'm Derek! <laughs> nay 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 Oh, a save point. <laughs> the dog starts barking. Shut up! Derek runs funny. Runs like he has to take a shit. Well, my hands are tied behind my back. 
He looks like he needs a ship. Hang on, hold it, hold it, clutch my cheeks, clutch your cheeks. <laughs> We've all been there, haven't we? Just like, oh, oh, gotta shake, gotta shake. <laughs> it's down the whole way to the left. <laughs> oh. The hell are these people? We're broadcasting your miserable deaths live on national television. Why a public execution in this day and age? With the chaos resulting from the media reports, we desperately need to rally public support. It's better that we punish somebody, anybody. You make me sick. They'll never admit it, but everyone loves this stuff. We'll start with this girl. Duh! <laughs> if you gotta do it, take me first. What kind of dance is that? I don't know. I can picture him singing that. What about you? <laughs> just doing that dance, just singing. Just like, if you gotta do it, take me first. <laughs> Camera this way, make sure you get this. The audience just eats up tearful goodbyes. No, I'm just dancing like a baboon. Oh, what is this? What is this? Ay! What are you doing? This is my special gas chamber. Take your time and enjoy a slow, painful death. Oh, come on. Come on. Did you just punch me in the tit? Excuse me. Did you just call me a stuck-up bitch? Ow! When I get my hands on you... Oh, you dropped the key. The show's about to begin. Uh-oh. Weapons approaching. Attention all military personnel, take your positions. Uh-oh. Perfect timing. Wait a minute, I know that body shape. I know that body shape. The fat dude in the suit. That's Catsy. That's Mippy. Yep. Mippy. How does it feel now, Scarlet? Hmm? So you didn't run? I'm impressed. How do I feel right now? Oh. <laughs> Sleeping gas? Hey, Mippy. Mippy. Oh, shit. He's feeling a bit nippy. Nippy! <laughs> nippy. Oh, I see oh you weird cat on a... Moogle. Body suit? It's a Moogle. Moogle. He's a fortune what teller machine. Oh. Why the fuck? Do you have a fortune toy machine fighting in your side? I... Uh, he's actually a Shinra spy of some kind, so he works for Shinra, but he was at the Golden Saucer. He read my fortune and... Well, one thing led to another and now he's at my party. So, what exactly is he? Because I'm hearing he's a toy, he's a fortune teller. He's a toy? I see a cat on some sort of dragon body suit since there's a zipper on the little white thing on, or the big white thing yeah. he's on top of. Yeah, the big white thing he's on top of is the fortune telling machine. It literally generates fortunes. The cat itself is also a robot. It's a toy robot. And yet somehow cats, the cat part of it, has an affair with a chocobo. <laughs> this game doesn't fucking make sense! <laughs> no part of this game makes sense! Uh, it's not really supposed- well, if you play it from the beginning to end, it's like, yeah, there's some plot holes in it, but it's being redone. I'm against capital punishment, besides, I hate this broad. Come on, we gotta help that Butana. I'll keep watching the entrance. Okay. Of that, that character does not make sense. Catsy doesn't make sense? Nothing makes sense. 
Your character is a clone who is fighting another clone of a dead man. One guy has a fucking assault rifle for an arm. The other character, which is one of the main characters, is currently sitting in a fucking gas chamber. And one of the men, main enemies is just called Weapon. Yeah, we're about ready to see one of them. There's four of them. We're about to see one. I think it's the mm. Emerald Weapon? Yeah, Emerald Weapon. Or is it Jade? Mm. It's one of the weapons. There's four of them, and I never beat Ruby or Jade. I never beat Ruby or Jade. There they are. They're going. Mm. That brain hurts my game. Huh? <laughs> brain hurts my brain. <laughs> Your brain is definitely hurting. None of this game makes sense. I bet you like that big gun, though. Big gun is nice, but game don't make no sense, though. <laughs> And why is there a nuke in that room? I... I, I did I didn't notice it until just now. Oh. Yeah, it's a nuke. <laughs> or at least it's a very big bomb. The fuck did he even hit? Weapon. That's ocean. Weapons in the ocean. Well, one of the weapons. That's Ocean. Ocean doesn't like gun. Well, that's Ocean. Just keep waiting. Just keep waiting, because all they did was piss it off. Just keep watching. The fuck is Weapon? It's a monster a weird... created by the planet to kill Genova, but they didn't have a reason to kill Genova, so the weapons have been asleep for more than 2,000 years. The planet created them to kill Genova, but instead of doing what they needed to do, they decided to be lazy as fucktards sleeping in the sea. No, they were sleeping in the crater that was at the north of the continent, but because Sephiroth has the black materia, the weapons are going out and trying to destroy any traces of Genova that are out in the world. So, in other words, they are just doing their job, but it's misdirected. It should be directed at Sephiroth. Because but... they didn't already do their job properly by sleeping. Yes. <laughs> so, some that shouldn't even exist if it was done properly. Yes. And just think, we have... How could some that its main directive is to destroy a certain creature that is made... By the planets that they live on, <laughs> possibly be that lazy. Look how fast it's going. 50 knots. That's actually rather slow. Wait for it. The cannon right takes on. a long time to reload. Regular firepower in the meantime. Get ready. Open all artillery doors, target weapon, don't let it land. Here it comes. There it is. Yeah, 50 knots is only 57 miles an hour. There it is. That's not very quick. It's no more than a giant fish. You shouldn't be using guns, you should be using guns. This makes no sense. 70 knots. Well, they're not exactly that. Tight. Now we're picking up the speed. Now we're going at 80 miles. Look, the weapons are just kind of bouncing off. Of it. Oh, that dude is so dead. The fact that they're trying to go against it is stupid in the first place. Yep. Oh. It's a living weapon. Derek, help! Hold your breath. Hold on as long as you can. Oh, come on! I can't get in there. The gas room's probably locked from a different room. 
Gotta go with their plan. Let's get out of this room first. Deputado, I'll help you, I promise! See, the problem is, is the key is in her room. Ah, oh, fuck. Now you can't save the girl. Time for plan, please. Let's run to the airport. Why the airport? And leave Dakutana there? Trust me, trust me. We gotta take a chance. Mipper. Hey. Nothing is fucking makes sense. I got all of Zerus' materia back. Oh. Oh no, I've got everyone's materia. All right then. Ooh, I have an idea. Do I have another all materia? No, I do not. Okay, um. Where the airport is. Not this way, apparently. Oh, it's... This way. That's not Friday. Is the airport this way? I would say, I guess it's in a big door. Oh shit. Verity! That's not Verity. Drop That's an idiot reporter. Wait, no, that is Verity. That's Verity. Who makes this noise? It's me, Verity. The hell you doing here? Oh shit! He's back. He's back. He's back. And he's pissed. He's but a kraken. You living. can find li fight a living weapon with a massive gun that takes too long to fucking reload. Can you blame them for being idiots? You look like you want to counter it, but you can't. <laughs> Your brain. They could have. What they could have done, instead of using so many dinkiest double barrel guns that don't do shit to it, is use the metal to make another giant ass cannon. That'll at least piss it off a slight bit more. Over doing nothing. Ah. You feel me? I d yeah, I do see the inconsistencies. Trust me, I ask it all the freaking time when I play this game or any game that's like this. It's like, it why don't they do this? You're just like, why don't they do this? Or why are they doing this? <laughs> Plus, if you have the two guns, what you do is, you fire one off, wait until halfway through the re-rolling process, fire the other one, that way by the time it's done, you can fire another one. Just keep doing that. And you have more of them, 
Boom, 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 boom. All down the line. He's got a volley fire. Even then, Basic the one military shot... tactics. Even then, the one shot they did fire on the weapon didn't do anything. It pissed it off, which means it did something. I think it just... It, I mean... Not you... much, but something. With enough shells in the same area, no matter what it is, it will blow up. I can kill a tank with a 22 with enough rounds on the exact same spot. Okay, fair enough. But consider this. They're idiots. <laughs> they are idiots. They never thought they'd ever have to deal with something like Weapon. And plus, also consider this. Weapon may have been hit dead on with that shot, but for all we know, it's probably the equivalent of being bit by a mosquito. That would be the same to a tank and a 22. But would you want to piss off something designed to dis not destroy the planet, but destroy something that came from freaking space? <laughs> would you want to piss it off? <laughs> My point still stands. Since if it was nothing more than a mosquito, like, while it was sleeping... Who? He wouldn't care! Well, it's definitely not asleep now, it's pissed! No! If it's awake from that shell going into its fucking cranium, it most likely gave it a fucking headache. I think it's like, excuse me, I've not had my morning coffee, how dare you! I'm gonna take my morning dump in that barrel. <laughs> Move your feet and arms and use your head to get out of the chair. Okay, menu, head, switch, arm, okay, okay, cancel, flex. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I think I need to do legs and head. Okay, uh, I think I need to use my head and get back up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Legs. And fuck. Come on. Head and right arm. Head and right arm. Come on. No. Head and left arm. All right. Head and left arm. All right. Left arm and right arm. No. 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 Hang on. No. No. She got. Oh, she got it. Okay. Okay. All right. That wasn't too bad. Which button stops the gas? Good question. Which button? Uh, better question. Use the key to open the door. Got it. Get out of the room, get out of the room. Get out of the room. Nope, it's locked. Oh shit. Uh-oh. What's he about to do? He's a living weapon. He's about to fire a shot. Oh god. Oh god. He's about to blow his load. Please don't tell me I'm in that room! Oh, he's got more shots. Oh! <laughs> See, it blew chunks off him. It definitely does something. Um, that was his head. <laughs> his yeah. head gone. His head's all gone. It does something to him. I think they, I think they missed. I think they missed their shot. <laughs> oh. Most likely. Oh, it did hit in you. <laughs> what did you do? Hey, open! No! First you locked me in this weird place, and now you're telling me to come out? Make up your mind. I'm gonna shove my boot up your ass. I'm about to kick your fucking ass. Well, she does kick and punch for a living. Are they chasing you? I don't know. I'm just getting out of here. Oh. <laughs> that would be a yes. Bye, buddy. <laughs> Ah! Bye. Woo, uh, oh, I'm alive. Fuck you, I'm out of here. Fuck you. I'm going to the gun. I'm going to the barrel of this gun. I will jump in the sea. Don't test me. I will do it. <laughs> I will do it. <laughs> barrel of the gun, jump in the sea. I, I got nowhere else to go. Is this thing called Sister Ray? Yes. 
I will jump into the sea. I have nowhere else to go. That thing is down there. Ew, the water's gonna be all slimy and... Ew. <laughs> ew. Oh, I mean, seawater already is kind of... Our little game of hide and seek ends here. Oh, hi, hi, hi. Hi, how you doing? The execution may have been unsuccessful, but your death by falling and crashing into the water below might still be pretty exciting. Oh. Well, shit. It's just like execution. I, I didn't... I didn't think this through. I didn't think this... Ow! Fuck off. Quit slapping me, you old bitch! <laughs> I've never done that before. <laughs> you're gonna see so your. Are you running away with your tail tucked between your legs because I slapped you? <laughs> Get back here. Oh, now it's time to pay up. Calm down or I'll drop you. So you lose a bitch slap contest and you're going to shoot me? Maybe next time don't pick a bitch fight contest with a martial arts master. You're not going to run. Who told me to run? Run to the end of the cannon. Okay. Who said that? Derek! I know the pretty bird. You ain't getting me! Woo! You ain't getting me my 8-bit ass! <laughs> my 8-bit ass! <laughs> Alright, this technically counts as 32-bit, doesn't it? I mean, it, I, I think it was actually 16-bit. But it's 32-bit with it ported on PC. I don't, I don't know. Oh, polygonal no. bits. No. You're not touching my polygons. <laughs> Either way, that gun is stupid. That base is stupid. Every bird about that fucking area is stupid. Everything about this game is retarded. But it's Hello, fun. little lady crammed into the side. <laughs> you buried over there? Yeah, she got seasick, so she's probably airsick. Oh, oh. My cheeks hurt a bit. Bitch. Which ones? Forget it, what's all this about? Well, I'll catch the details later. In any case, the airship High Wind is now yours. Thanks. Hey, how you doing? That's not normal. Can you not look up my skirt? <laughs> well, you're both women. I have a point there. Yeah, you do. But at the same time, we don't like it when anyone sees our underwear. Fair point. <laughs> Smacks you with a good dose of I got you on that. Fair point. Okay. Hanging your tongue to a guy who is comfortable in walking around the fucking house with only underwear on. Yes. I guess if the rule of no shirt, no shoes didn't exist, I would gladly walk up to the store with only underwear. Hey, why didn't you tell me you could fly an airship? I thought Tabutana was gone for good. Sorry, but I'd do something to trick the enemy. Come on, everyone's waiting. Everyone? Oh. I doubt Zerus is here, though. Wait. Zerus is dead. Wait. <laughs> Oh, that's right! That's right! That's how I got my chocobo from point A to point B! I used the airship and I stored the chocobo in the little corral in there! Oh god, I have to start chocobo breeding. 
Oh, God. Welcome to my airship, the high wind. Hey, anus. <laughs> you spelled it anus. I know. Anus. <laughs> Once an anus, always an, an anus. <laughs> anus is spelled A-N-U-S, not A-E-N-U-S. I, I know. I just made it look like a name. <laughs> so why did you... I just made it look like a name instead of just calling him an anus. 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 Enus. <laughs> anus. That would be enus. Not always, though. That's anus. Anus. <laughs> anus. <laughs> what is wrong? You should be more excited. Yeah. Look at it. Look at Bjorn just sitting down there like a good pup. Bjorn just anus. <laughs> Can you imagine? Anus. You know, you could hear his voice in, a in Advent Children. I can just picture him going. Anus. <laughs> just like that. <laughs> Is he an Advent Children? Yeah, at the end. He actually speaks at the end of Advent Children. I can't remember. Advent I have the movie. Shit. Yeah. Every time I'll give you the I can remember is the combination Buster Sword thing. Hmm? And his motorcycle that holds like 50 different swords, yet he only grabs the three. What, this? With a combo sword. I can't see it. Glare's a bit crappy. Fuck. <laughs> oh yeah, I won the food lottery last night. Oh. I have uh, baby cut carrots, and I had a full carrot. Don't you dare. Neither of you. Don't you dare. <laughs> Don't you dare. I think her baby carrot is growing a boner. <laughs> I was waiting for it. Hang on. I don't know what she would be thinking, but... First off, that's the movie case. Sending it now. That motorcycle. Yeah. Yep, same movie. I told you I won the food lottery. I don't know if a banana in your pocket or are you just happy to see me? <laughs> What's that sad yep, face? Yep, that's just a whole ass carrot. I got a carrot! I don't get the point of baby carrots. It's just literally whole carrots ground down in size. Meteor is coming and weapon is on the rampage. At a time like this, I don't know what I'm supposed to do. No idea at all. <laughs> get a hold of yourself, Duck Butana. Come on, let's think about this. No way we can get off of this train we're on. Only Zerus is here. Everything will be fine. Zerus would stand that cocky little way he did and tell us what to do. He'd say everything's under control, Duck Butana. Deputana, when did you become such a wimp? I'm sorry, Derek. I'm so depressed, I'm surprised at myself. And Deputana, the reason why we all thought it was Zerus was because... I know. That's why I want to make sure. That's why I have to see him again. I don't know where the hell he is. <laughs> Dead. Six feet under. In so glad you're alright, Deputana. Well, at least Matthias is pretty blunt about it. Um... I feel like we're missing someone. We've spoken with Verity. We've got Mippy on the bridge, Derek, Anus, Matthias, and Bjorn. I feel like we're missing some... Oh, right. The person we're missing is dead. Yeah. And I don't mean Zerus. <laughs> Amazing. Serene. Yeah, they are very dead. Hi. Sorry, go speak to Captain Anus. Son of a bitch. <laughs> Go speak to Captain Anus. <laughs> That's why I named him Anus. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to know I didn't dislike him. I gotta admit, he was a strange dude. Just when he thought he was cool, he'd do some damn fool thing. Then when he thought he was smart, he'd show how stupid he was. <laughs> <laughs> why does that sound like a call out? Why does that sound like a call out. <laughs> what? A man swings around a massive ass sword around his head. I wonder how he learned how to do that. Oh, I don't know. 
grab the sword, swing it around the head a few times, bash his skull open. <laughs> no, what I do now, I can see why he was that way. Well, as long as you stay alive, you just might see him again someday. So cheer up, sis. You call me that again, and I'm gonna punch you. If we can find out where he is, the high wound will get us there in no time. What's up, Bjorn? Please, for the Hello. love of God, tell me he's about to sniff him out. This is her. Yes, that, that works. Alright. Thank you. Goodbye. Mm. Pathways. Mm. I love how I just kind of stared at my phone like, <laughs> Either way, please tell me for the love of God he's about to say I can sniff him out. Maybe. Xeris is still stuck in the North Crater, where the ground cracked and swallowed him up. Buried in the depths of the underground. Deeper than the so underground. he's in hell. Are you talking about the live stream? The live stream sometimes gushes out from cracks in the ocean floor to the surface. I heard about such a place. Well, you want to tell us where that is? Maybe. Just maybe Xeris is... Tell us where that is? That would help. Cheer up, Dabutana. Yeah, you ass. If we can find out where he is, the high one will get us there in no time. Well, <laughs> what? Is Xeris always got to be around? We did fine without him in the beginning, right? And what happened to the tough girl I used to know? Where'd she go to? Kiss my ass. Why is the flop is the actual character? I just I want to find him, please. And have to start chocobo breeding and everything. God. You. I got. <laughs> Can we leave? Maybe I talk to this guy. Pilot in training level 3. Debaton, sorry, but I gotta show this more on how to land the ship. Don't worry, it'll be done in a minute. Oh, and Debutana, no matter what your goal is, you've gotta be prepared. Go to the operation room and get ready. You, I'm gonna shove my boot up your ass! No, I'm gonna shove my boot up your anus. <laughs> Well, if you're going to shove boot up your anus, where are you going to shove up your boot up anus? <laughs> I did not get that far. <laughs> <laughs> I got you there! Uh, I need to get the materia off of Derek and, um, Mippy. And I don't think Verity had anything on her, did she? No, she kind of just ran around. I think. Check. I don't think she had anything on it. Oh. Oh, she did. So I'm stuck with Dut Rutana in my party. She seems to be the new party head. Alright, Bjorn has everything. Matthias has everything. It's just her. Okay. Um Restore. All. Wait, I need to use a different all material. Not that one. Which one? Which one's old? That's old. That's old. Time. All. Revive. Come. Okay. Ugh. Baby bird. What? Are they the exact same materials? 
Oh, materia is what gives you your magic abilities. They are pure concentrated uh, energy of the life stream that condense and form materia. Mm. And what exactly does the all materia do? Uh, the all materia allows me to use the magic on every single opponent or target. Mm. Signal I'm ready to fly full speed. Okay. We're going. How do I... How do I... That looks like your control is exactly like your brawn. Uh, Any north... I can't go north because there's a barrier blocking Sephiroth. I am going to check out the Fort Condor, though. Fuck! Wrong button. <laughs> How long have I been playing this game? Oh, let's see. 26 years? <laughs> Almost. <laughs> God. Well, no, the game's been around for 26 years. I've been playing it since I was, like, 7. So, 19 years. <laughs> I I've can't... been playing Halo since I was 3, so 15 years. I feel old again. God, the Shinra troops have been attacked, have attacked five times since they were here. Perfect timing just around the corner. I'm going to contribute gil. Uh, I have plenty of gil to spare, so I'm just going to keep throwing my money at you. Take my money! That's enough money for now if we run out. Uh, should I just let them handle it? Yeah. Do it. Okay, they're good. Can I go outside? Okay, no. No. God, shouldn't I attack this place five times since I was gone? That's insane. What's even more insane is I'm not used to running around as freaking Death Butana. Uh, if I'm gonna do any chocobo breeding, I need to double check that I have chocobo lore on. Why are random people attacking that place anyways? That's Shinra, a better question. The Shinra wants to destroy, or not destroy, they want to get these people out of here because this used to be a reactor. And they want the meteor, or not the meteor, the materia that's in this reactor. But there's a condor that lives on it, and they want to protect the condor. Shinra don't care for the condor, they want to get rid of it. So the people you're helping is nothing but an environmentalist group of dumbasses. I wouldn't really call them environmentalists, they just live here. They live here and they protect the condor. I mean, so, environmentalists. I mean, you'd protect your giant bird if you were living there. If I was living there before the bird got there, yes. Okay, I'm looking, up, I'm looking up the Chocobo breeding guide because I need to find out which Chocobos I need. Uh, all of them? No, I need a very specific one. Let's see. Wild Chocobos can be encountered, blah, 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 blah. Stables open after our party has acquired high wind. Okay, Chocobo player must speak to the man inside the house to rent the stables. Stables cost 10,000 gil and a total of six can be rented at once. Okay, the Chocobo Farms! So instead of actually getting Sarah's back, you're going to be Chocobo Farming. Yes! <laughs> Maybe I want to run around as a lady for a while. <laughs> <laughs> What does the world come to? Stars falling? What's next? With things the way they are now, how about raising a chocobo? No, I'm not trying to persuade you for money. It's just because of the way the things are in the world. thought that would be a healthy thing for you to raise some chocobos. You just happen to be in luck. Just so happens that we aren't taking care of any chocobos for anyone else. So, I take care of six chocobos right now for 10,000 gil per chocobo. Yeah! To raise a chocobo, you need a chocobo stable, and they rent for 10,000 gil. Currently, I can rent out six stables. 
you run a chocobo stable, will keep up to four of the chocobos you catch in the fenced area outside. At a later date, you can select a chocobo that you would like to put in your chocobo stable. Chocobo stables cost 10,000 gil. Rent. I need... I'm gonna buy all of them. I need to breed birds! See, I have to catch specific types of chocobos, feed them specific types of greens, feed them specific types of nuts. That way you can get the golden chocobo, go across where the fuck you need to go in order to get what? A useless item? Uh, a materia, the ultimate materia. Which is the, uh, Knights of the Round. It's worth it. How much more guild do I have? Oh. <laughs> yes. <laughs> How much more gil do I have? <laughs> Alright. Um, let's see. Most of the nuts in the game are useless, and the lower grade nuts have a chance to produce chocobos whose stats are lower than that of the parent. The only nuts worth using are carob and zayo nuts. Carob nut is used to breed the first blue and green chocobos. Zayo nuts are the best nuts when it comes to stats. Carob nuts can be stolen from Lacrodosis or bought at Wonder Square. And Zale we're not looking for stats, we're just trying to get the actual chocobo. And then I have to race the chocobos. Let's Hurts see. my head. Let's see. <sighs> oh! Yeah, there's more materia caves that can only be accessed by the chocobos. Mime quadra magic. Yes, to that and makes sense. You got a fucking flying boat. I can't land in forests. I have to land only on the grass. Can land on the grass beside the forest. Nope. <laughs> and go through the forest <laughs> on foot. You don't need a fucking bird for that. What? I need a bird. <laughs> I need to buy plenty of green. Why did I do that? Why did I flip and do that? Hello. Why do you have greens? Because I told me to give it away. I need to catch and some birds. Alright. So here's what I'm gonna do. Uh, let's see. Where's the Zacrodosis? Or Blackrodosis. Where's the Blackrodosis? You can do that. Icicle area uh, battle. There. Blackrodosis. Patches of grass of the icicle area. Okay, I know where to find them. I need to go north. Damn it. I'm gonna breed birds. Okay. Alright. See, I can only land here. So you can't land in the snow? Nope. That makes no sense. Plus, who said you need to land? I need to catch the bird. Okay, he has chocobo bird. Geisel greens are under the elixirs. Okay. Arrange. Customize. I'm gonna move the Geisel greens. There. Yes. Okay. Let's go get some birds. This will be fine. <laughs> Thanks, Cherry. Hmm? Cherry's just provided a very good question. Oh, damn it, there was a patch of grass right here. I'm going back from my high window. Yeah. I thought she was about to say, time to go catch some cock. Well, there's that too, but something about Dubutana specifically. <clears throat> She's a martial arts master. Think about it. Yeah. I wouldn't want her going anywhere near my junk.
How do you get it? Good point. Oh, there it is. Hey, buddy. Oh. Thanks. You spat an enemy skill material at me. Hey, buddy. Hi. Can't remember how long it's been since my last guest. Who are you? Me, I'm... I don't know. <laughs> you don't know who you are? Been a while since I gave it any thought. What was it they used to call me? Oh yeah, they used to call me the Chocobo Sage. Right, that was it, the Chocobo Sage. Who would forget that? Now what can I do for you? Tell me something. Mmm, see these nuts are useless. The ones I need are Carob and Zayo nuts. Coming through. What's that? I need Carob and Zayo nuts. I get the carob nuts here, in the grass, in this area. But, I want to catch chocobos in this area, too. Specifically, damn it! Specifically, I need the wonderful chocobos. Bet, bet. Ah. <sighs> I'm about ready to enter the most irritating part of this entire game because I want those materials. Here it is. God, the memories. God, the memories. I hate this. I hate it, but I love it. Nope, no chocobo. Just a bunny. For a while. See, that's another thing I have to worry about. There's a distinct chance I'm gonna catch a chocobo, and say I have the chocobo I need that is a male, and then I need to catch a wonderful chocobo that's freaking female, and I keep catching male chocobos. <laughs> Damn it! Wouldn't it be easier to catch a female chocobo to start off control, with? You can't control what gender it will be. It's literally 50-50. I know that, but wouldn't it be easier to can catch a female chocobo? That well, way... I mean, I don't know if I'm going to breed a male or not. It'll always be 50-50. And I can only carry so many chocobos in my stable. Damn. What exactly is the black redosis anyways? Why are you fighting rabbits? I don't know. What are you? There ain't nothing special about those rabbits, it's just they're rabbits. Let's see. Manipulate. You wield their bee. carrots like jumping bee. Ow. I missed. Yeah, yeah. Well, um, I'm gonna up into the other chest. It's that came from the What? I'm gonna hop into the VR for a bit. Thank you about this game is breaking my brain. <laughs> I'll join you in a moment. I broke your brain. <laughs> <laughs> Everything about this game just doesn't make sense. None of the Final Fantasy. I'll see you inside. 